How you doing there, YouTube? This is uh, Hannon 2112, and I am on Gal Zero or Galzo, as I like to say it. Um, probably one of my cooler looking characters. Again, yeah, not my best. He's about a 57 CR, full T2, T2.5, uh, 103.5. This is about a probably ready for FOS 1 and FOS 3. Would um, depending on the player, maybe fast 2, again, you have to be relatively decent just to go into fast 2 yourself, but a lot of people make the mistake of going in there, just as soon as you hit 53 CR and you have no idea what you're doing, you should not be stepping into fast 2, but, um, definitely, like, uh, a player that knows what they're doing can take in, uh, this character and go into fast 2 and not have a problem, but, um, yeah, full T2, 103, Pistols. I don't want the pistols. I wanted the bow, but I haven't played this guy in months. I literally months since I played him last. And when I first signed, first signed on to him, I went to go, you know, build up the supercharge, get ready for this, and I hit triangle, expecting my bow to pop out, and I'll pass these ugly looking pistols I got here. So, if you can just imagine like a really cool looking bow on him every time I hit triangle. No, oh God, no, my fury's attack. Uh, that'd be great. Uh, so let's look at the skill points here. 51. Um, you want to go might and then critical attack, chance, and damage. Those two flip flop. But you can you want all 70 something skill points to be successful um, DPS. And if you if you want to do good, you get all the skill points and you put them where they need to be. Um, for loadouts, for my damage loadout here. I got them, I, I summon my, my furry. Um, nothing like having a good old furry come to your side. Uh, circle of destruction, big, circle, AoE, lots of damage. Um, anything in it. It's it's a good dot, uh, along with Soulwell. Soulwell I used to have clipped with Boon of Souls. Now, if maybe if I had like one more power splot, I would definitely use that. But... Uh, the pet is definitely debatable if you want to get rid of it, but the boon of souls doesn't really damage. It, it doesn't damage. It's I would only be using it to clip a move, which uh, it definitely comes down to how you want to, how you want to play it. But this is how I do it. Um, so yeah, so well, uh, vacuum bubble is my supercharge. Sorcery supercharges are a little weak. Um, maybe for if you're PVPing, it'd be a little different, but. For PvE, Vacuum Bubble is sick. Uh, Final Ruin, good 35% health or below move. Uh, it's it, it's not the best, I would definitely say uh, Paling Thorns is pretty ridiculous on that. But Final Ruin is pretty good, really good actually. Um, Weapon of Destiny is probably the, the the biggest move in the entire thing. It's, it's spammable, it's nasty, it's... It, that's exactly what it is. It's spammable and nasty. I can't target Robin. Alright, so we're going to be up, beating up Aquaman. Um, so, summon your fury. Uh, I would probably start off with Circle, just to get some initial ticks going, and then Solwell. Now, I like to jump just to be able to move to get out of it. I do a little tank, and then I go into Weapon of Destiny. Wait until that's done. Weapon of Destiny. Circle. And then just keep spamming Weapon of Destiny. Every time your circle goes down, make sure you cast it on a large area where there will be lots of ads. And every time you can keep spamming your circle. Or, um, so well. Do that as well. And then it, from there, it's just spamming. Spamming circles. Spamming Weapon of Destiny. And then when you get them down to about 35%, that was a little early. Um, I mean, this thing's 750, 916. Um, 760 was a little early. But you're pretty much just spamming the two moves over and over again. And it works. It's a really good move. Um, pretty good loadout. I've beaten some relatively high gear. There's a 1500 crit. It's nothing crazy, but... You know, for only being 57 CR and pretty low might, I would 
say that's bad. Now for um, the supercharge vacuum bubble, sick vacuum bubble, uh, su sick supercharge vacuum bubble is. Uh, so I'll trinket, circle, and vacuum bubble, and then 130s over and over again. And that's nasty. And then, I mean, there's nothing better than weapon vesting. 130s critting in there. Then you get him down to 35%. So if you're fighting a Brainiac, this is definitely spammable as you can see. You can just continually do this over and over again. But this is relatively easy power to use. I would probably say this and fire pretty much basic power sets. Fire forget. Um, spammable. There's there's other there's, they definitely take there's a skill to still knowing what, what you're doing here. But I mean like thirty the thirty five percent uh, getting down to that uh, just knowing what thirty five percent of someone's health is that's just eventually you'll just realize hey, you know, that time it didn't take that much and it was probably around, you know, this letter. Maybe that's how you want to do it. Um, I mean, I just, I see that he only has 35% health left. I mean, that's just for playing for a while. And, uh, right there. That's about, that's about the top of 35%. And then sometimes, um, I'm not sure if this works perfect, but if you do the first tick, it's usually a little bit lower, like the... seeing the first tick. Oh, 112. And the next one's 345. So I'm not sure if the, the 112, say I did that and hit him and it knocked him back down to um, that knocked him to 35%. I don't know if the next hit would consider to be the 35%. I just do it. As soon as it's 35%, I hit it. I don't try to wait until, you know, I, I try to hit the first one to get him under 35%. You know, he's above it, then I hit it, and then try to get him below, and then if not, it's a failure and it's a waste of move. Because, I mean, the 345 for a uh, final ruin is kind of weak. Definitely not a, um, a worth it attack if you're if that's how you're gonna do it. So one last time up here. Um, circle, trinket, vacuum bubble. Vacuum bubble is one of the most ridiculous supercharges in the game. Uh, again, higher mites will obviously give you more, but it's just, this is a pretty basic power set. Is just spamming weapon of destiny circles and solos. And then final ruin when you get to it. Oops, I want to do final ruin. I remember. I think I flip flopped them when I was setting up the low. There's a 1500 crit. That's nice. Alright. So, uh, yeah. Thank you for watching. Uh, maybe you want to give it a like, sub, comment, all that sort of fun stuff that I do enjoy. Um, definitely makes it worth it making these. Last couple of them have gotten pretty good reviews, I guess. Uh, there's always people who always have better ways, and I'm willing to uh, learn. Maybe someone has a different way, maybe someone has a different clip for so well, anything. I'm all ears. So, um, yeah, thank you for watching.